yo. Uh, when it back up. There we go. Yes, it's me. Uncharacteristically early. <laughs> um. Well, first of all, yes, hi, it's me, the Universe Traveler, here again. More Pokemon! I went to bed at midnight last night, local time. Slept for like five hours, <laughs> and then woke up at 5 a.m. Uh, couldn't go back to sleep. So then I just decided, forget it. <laughs> Got up, did some laundry, took out the garbage, watched some YouTube, started a little drawing, uh, and then remembered that today was Saturday and I needed to stream. I didn't, well, I say need. I don't have to. But I was like, it's stream day today. I was like, ah. Yeah, today's stream day today. So it's like, well, okay, what do I want to do? I, it's like, I know I wanted to, I already promised that I was going to do Pokemon today. And it was like, okay, yeah, I kind of want to do Pokemon again, because I got to I gotta do the bug catching contest again. I got to do better than last time. Uh, and, uh, but it's like, I also want to draw, because I've got a mermaid piece that I want to do, so that way I can at least say I did something for Mermaid, because you know me well enough, I love mermaids. Mermaids are one of my favorite, I don't know, mythological creatures, demi-humans, cryptids, uh, monster people, uh, I don't know what you classified mermaid as, but I love mermaids, one of my favorites, and every time I see, every time Mermaid rolls around, I love seeing what everybody makes for the month, in celebration for it, and uh, I never get around to making making anything, so it's like I wanted to do something for this month, you know, as a slight change of pace. So I wanted to sit down and do that, and I thought about doing it on stream today, but it's like I already wanted to do that. And then it was like, Pokemon, but then Sonic Unleashed has also been sort of nagging, like <laughs> gnawing at the back of my mind going, come on, you want to play it again? I know you want to. So I was like, you know what? I got up early. Um, I might as well just stream Pokemon and get that out of the way. And then uh, go for a little bit and then um, maybe end off and then stream again this afternoon. Who knows? So, that is uh, what I was planning on doing. So, <laughs> I should get home from business too. Yeah! And I was a little worried, didn't know what the turnout was going to be, but, you know, I was like, you know, I'll start close enough to noon, and, you know, we'll just see what happens. Um. Wait, which is funny because, I don't know, it's funny how I, today starting out is as almost like. Um, not really a complete inverse of what yesterday was like, because I got up later than I did yesterday, and uh, had to do some responsible things, and uh, <laughs> everything turned out okay in the end, which is so funny, because I was because yesterday I had to do some responsible stuff, and I was expecting to have to deal with the I don't want to say consequences, but it's like you know yet you, you got to take your lumps with life, and turns out. I didn't have to at that point, so I was very happy with how it turned out. <clears throat> so, uh, Pokemon. I know clues. You like my so shocking. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. There are so many. I've. I was thinking about doing. This was a random spur of the moment idea that I had among many, um, I thought about doing a, my favorite, uh, my favorite tropes, like, Monster Girls or something like that, and just doing, like, a whole series of, like, single images of, like, my favorite, like, types, I guess. 
Um, and like doing like mermaids and like moth girls and all that other stuff and just doing like a whole series on that. But then it's like, you know, <laughs> on top of everything else you do, yeah, it ain't gonna happen. So, anyways, Pokemon. So, last we left off, uh, I got attacked by a bee, <laughs> by, a <laughs> by a murder hornet, and got my ass kicked, and I lost the bug catching contest, wherein I kind of got... I freaked out a little bit <laughs> and uh yeah it didn't turn out the way I hoped so I did some grinding afterwards because I just needed to cool off after after that so I went through and I battled the police officers along the daycare route which is the that route whose number that designation I completely forget what it is um and I think I battled the other police officer that's, like, near the National Park. Um... So I did that. Uh, and then I went and did some grinding. So I got everybody up to level 20, except for Sandshrew, who's just, um, HM slave for now. Um, I caught some other Pokemon. Uh, I caught an Oddish, um, a Psyduck, which I will use for an HM Slave. Um, and I think I caught a few other Pokemon as well. But uh, they, that I won't, I'm not going to use them in the party. I just needed them for utility purposes. Um, and uh, I caught uh, Nidorina, although I, and I will be using Nidorina as part of my team. Uh, for a little bit. I don't know if I'm going to replace them with anything. Um, but, yeah, I got got my girl. I love Nidorina. Love Nido, uh, Nidoran, the female line of Nidoran specifically. Nidorina and Nido Queen are some of my favorites. Um, in leveling up everybody, uh, my Hutu devolved into Noctowl. Um, I will be taking him him? Them? Uh, yeah. Taking him back through the bug catching contest, and, uh, hopefully he'll stand a bit more of a chance. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, oh, I did get the, the quick claw from the lady in the national park, too. So I need to hit 420. <laughs> okay. I need to make sure that I'm not. Uh, I haven't filled up the box. Today's Saturday. That means the bug catching contest is on today. The rules are simple. Need one Pokemon. Uh, catch a Pokemon to be judged. Um, one one Pokemon. You have to use Noctowl. First Pokemon in your party. So keep with you. Yes. Always good to fight the authority. Hell yeah. A cab baby. All right, look at the, the attendant. Do, 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 do. Um, let's see, what else am I going to do? So for this this session, I'm not gonna be going for too long. Um, I'm going to be going through Goldenrod Gym, I think, and uh, attempting, and it's a very you know strong word, I'm going to be attempting to try and beat that gym today and uh, to get the water bottle so I can clear Sudowoodo out of the pathway. Hit park balls. Strong spoke Pokemon's winner. You have 20 minutes. If you run out of park balls, you're done. You can keep the last Pokemon you catch as your own. Go out and catch strong spoke Pokemon you can find. So let's hope that this uh, turns out a bit better than last time. Don't want to try and catch my Scyther. 
I really hope that Scyther is actually available in uh, in this game, because I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it is. You didn't look it up? Well, no. <laughs> I did look at uh, the National Park. Uh, like, once. <laughs> but I didn't retain the Pokemon that appeared. Ooh! Butterfree, though! Butterfree! <laughs> oh, that's one of my favorites. Okay. Just Googled it's there. Okay. Yeah, oh well never mind. <laughs> oh no, I think I've made a I think I've made a mistake. <laughs> Yeah, and I just looked up the... I looked up Poke Earth on Cerebi, and, uh... Turns out, um, all the bug Pokemon that you can catch in the Bug Catching Contest are the same across all versions, which is nice. Please just work with. <gasps> no! <laughs> no! I, buddy, I love you. Thank you. I. Mm. Sucks. So mad. I may have jinxed myself by just thinking no crit. Just a fucking goddamn. <laughs> I really hope this is like 20 actual minutes and not 20 like in-game minutes. If I don't get my Scyther out of this. I will throw out, I will do away with the Game Shark Clause for this one instance. Because while it is, it would be nice to win the bug catching contest and get, like, the prize for it, which, not really a spoiler or anything. The, the grand prize you get for winning the bug catching contest is a Sunstone. Uh, which you can use to evolve Gloom into, uh... Blossom, or sun current into some flora if you're a madman. Um, I would really like to get that as a prize, but honestly, I just want to get my Scyther out of this. Because I love Scyther. Scyther's so cool. Keep searching. 
something mad. I guess while I'm doing this, though, I do want to uh, talk about um, a Scyther, though, that I had in the past. Uh, when I was a kid, um, I had uh, I had a Scyther in Pokemon Gold, and I really wanted a um, a Caesar. Is it is it Caesar or Sizor? I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it's Caesar, right? Sizor? I don't know. Anyways, I really wanted Sizor, and I had myself. <gasps> Oh, 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 okay. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, where, where, hold on, hold on. We're gonna do a save state. Okay. Uh, and anyways, I, uh, had a Scyther, and I wanted to see a uh, Scyzor, and I did not remember as a kid how you got Caesar. And I leveled up my Scyther to, like, 60 or something like that. And I got that Scyther was like Oh come on, 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 please, please, baby, please. Um And I got this thing up to god level. It had slash, I think it had Fury Cutter too. Yes! 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 Let's fucking go! It's very proud of its speed. It moves so fast that its opponent does not even know what knocked it down. Caught Scyther. Well. <laughs> well, <laughs> there's nothing left for me to do at this point. I've won the game. I don't... <laughs> I don't... I've won the game. <laughs> I don't. I don't. Fuck, fuck that. I don't care anymore. <laughs> oh. oh boy. Anyways, I I got this site there right. Leveled it up to like sixty or something like that. It was insane. Uh, I guess we could just get Noctowl up to like level twenty or twenty one. Uh, because you can get some pretty easy XP. I have the type advantage. Um. Um, and then I remembered, oh, you're supposed to trade the, you're supposed to trade Scyther with, um, uh, with, with the Metal Coat, right? In order to evolve it. So, I... Got my family member to a family member of mine who at the time had silver, and I was like, "Hey, could you do this for me?" And I'm gonna trade you the scyther, and I'm gonna evolve, um, and I'm going to evolve my scyther. And they were like, "Okay." So I traded it. He evolved. So cool. And I was like, "Awesome, cool. Can I have my? Can I have him back now?" And they were like, "No." And then they kept it. The Scyther that I raised with my own two feet was taken from me. And I never got them back. And, uh, and you can imagine my sadness when I learned that, you know, uh, Pokemon save batteries don't, 
uh, last forever. And that Scyther slash Scyzor is, and er, was, lost to time. Which made me very sad. so much. So. <laughs> now, but now I, in my adult years, I can raise my own Scyther and get a Caesar on my own. And I can be, uh, and I can rest content knowing that there are people that won't jerk me around and steal my Pokemon. Also, if you do happen to be watching this, you know who you are, you know who you are, and I still remember that you did that, and I hope you'll feel bad about it, because that sucked. Anyways, uh, we're I went and got those two items, and when we're done with the Bug Kitchen contest, I also remembered I still need to clear the National Park out of the trainer battles, so we'll be doing that um, after the contest is over. Have a great time watching this. Got tortilla chips, salsa, and bug type pain. <laughs> uh, I I really need to like figure out how to save clips from these from these streams, so that way I can have some easily shareable quote unquote hashtag content. So that way I could I can share that. Ooh, a pincer. That's cool. Another probably surefire winner to this contest, but uh, I'm not gonna get it because I already have my Scyther, and I'm perfectly content with having uh, Scyther. <laughs> I never heard you so <laughs> heard you so height. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it is lately, but I've I've just been feeling more energized when it comes to like playing games on stream and stuff like that. I don't know. Something about it. And maybe, or maybe it's just the lack of sleep. <laughs> it just has me, like, wired tired. And now that I think about it, I think I've seen every bug Pokemon that there is to see in the Bug Kitchen contest. Now that I think about it. And I'm looking at the list now, and I think I've seen them all now. Sounds deserve to not mentor his Pokemon with your feet. I, I've assumed, I assume you've seen or, and or heard of Game Grumps. That's a pretty, it's a pretty popular reference. It's like a, I'd, I'd assume people would know about that. The bananas has gone bad. Is a game crump? That <laughs> sounds dumb. <laughs> well, I mean, for a while there, it wasn't dumb. <laughs> or, I don't know, maybe that seems okay, that's a little mean. I don't know, it depends on who you ask. For a while there, I used to. I used to watch Game Grumps a lot. I was. I was there through the John Tron era. Uh, yeah, and I watched quite a, quite a bit of it. Um, for a while, that the, that was my my go-to YouTube content, um, and then I watched a bit of the the Dan stuff, and uh, I don't know when when it was that I like really fell off, but I, it was it wasn't like sudden or anything. It was kind of gradual, where I was where my interest kind of waned a little bit, and I was watching other people's content and stuff like that. I keep saying content when I... <laughs> I don't like using content. Ooh, another pincer!
Man, I really wish you could catch more than one Pokemon. Because I'm pretty sure if you can... You can catch more than... You can catch more than one, but you can only keep the one the one that you catch. I think that's the rule. I'm pretty sure that's the rule. Yeah, you keep the last one you catch. Yeah. And, uh, I caught, <laughs> uh, and I've caught Scyther, so Scyther is the one that I will keep. Um, but yeah, uh, my favorites are the Game Grump stuff. Um, I, I really liked Dan's, uh, solo playthroughs with, like, uh, Space Quest and uh, King's Quest and stuff like that. Those were those were fun to watch and fun to go back to every now and then. Cause I really I really like the chill vibe of just you know sitting with somebody and another pincer. Dang. <laughs> really trying to tempt me away from my scyther, huh? Why did I do that? <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> Why did I do that? You fool. <laughs> if that... If Pinsir got in the ball, I would be so mad. Ugh. Uh, another favorite of mine. I, I really like the... Oh, that one game. It was a PlayStation 1 game they played. It was one of Eric Chahi's games. It was like... Was it like Into Darkness or something like that? It's that uh, side-scrolling platformer that's like like, bone-crushingly hard. Uh, that playthrough is still... That one's one of my favorites. The the rage that they... That Eren achieves is... Phenomenal. I think I, I think I need to. I don't know if like if I should end this prematurely or not. Cause I I don't know if it'll. Cause I feel like this. I feel like it should have been over by now. Speaking of grumps, hey Barry! <laughs> you should weaken bug Pokemon first, then throw a ball. True, and I think putting them to sleep also helps. Shh, you'll scare off Scyther. I'll talk to you later. Oh, I was gonna be... I was gonna laugh my ass off if... <laughs> this Pokemon was a... Was a Scyther. You're stuck for eternity until you kill a Scyther. Well, I mean, I've done that already. <laughs> it's like, I've killed one and I caught one. Uh, I forgot the time to chat. Go find some bug Pokemon. I already found mine. <laughs> the only thing that'll get me to trade this Scyther is if I find another Scyther. And it, and it's shiny. Oh, there we go. Beep. Time's up. Doo -doo -doo. We will now judge the Pokemon you've caught. We have chosen the winners. Are you ready for this? <laughs> you ready for this? <laughs> bop, 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 bop. Do, 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 do. You remember Crazy Frog? I remember Crazy Frog. Placing third was Bugcatcher Josh, who caught... A Scyther. Okay. Score was 329 points. Placing second was Picnicker Cindy. 
Who caught a Butterfree? Wait. So who won? Was it me? Winner is... It was me! Who caught a Scyther? Ha! My Scyther is better than that other schmuck Scyther. I have the best Scyther. <laughs> you, do you know who you are? I am! <laughs> Wonder who win? Yeah, it's me. <laughs> Josh got fucked over. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. <laughs> 373 points! The number one finisher wins Sunstone. You mean a Sunstone. Awesome. I'll take it. Chris put the Sunstone in the item pocket. Please join us for the next contest. We'll return the Pokemon we kept for you. Here you go. Give a nickname to Scyther uh, you received. Nah, Scyther's good. Your party's full, so the Pokemon was sent to your box in pill pills. Bill's PC. Benny, congrats! You have earned my respect. You won? That's great! Do you feel like looking for bug Pokemon with me? I, I can't believe I lost at bug catching. <laughs> I completely decimated this guy! <laughs> this poor man! <laughs> uh, it's a different color, Celeste points. Yeah, he caught a shiny. <laughs> and they're like, it's shiny. Get it out of here. Hurts my eyes. What does... Hold on. Now I gotta know. What does... Old Shiny Scyther look like? Not great. <laughs> it's... It just has red accents. Instead of, like... Green... Green accents. It looks terrible. Pink neck. Oh, old no clue. Yeah, it's... Yeah, it doesn't look great. It just has, like, red bits in it. Eh, it's kind of meh. Uh, that Pokemon you caught. It's awesome! He thinks. Next time, I'm going to win. Um, is there anybody I, I'd swap out? Oh, yeah, Noctowl kind of took a beating. Yeah, because I couldn't heal. Um, we'll go to the Pokemon Center and we'll... We'll, we'll get you squared away, buddy. Um, yeah, if I don't need um, a cut, I'll be I'll replace Sandshrew with uh, with Scyther, and uh, we'll we'll put, put him in the bench. Okay. Um, before we clear out the national park, though. Oh, by the way. Uh, I don't think we actually got to, like, hear this theme in full, in full, but I talked about it before. I love this song. It's so good. Uh, this version specifically. The remake version, I'm kind of, eh, on. But, uh, I love this, this version of the National Park theme. It's so good. sure I got this on stream. Um, I got the bike. Bikel. <laughs> yep, good old Bikel. Right. 
man. I'm I'm chuffed as chips now. I got my I got Scyther. A total 180 from last week. I'm feeling great. Um. So yeah, let's go fight some trainers. My Pokemon are simply darling. Let me tell you how proud my darlings make me. Um, if it's the person that I'm thinking of, I'm pretty sure this person only has one Pokemon. Pokemon Beverly! Yeah, you only have one. <laughs> I hate that I've started back on my Pokemon region, because now I'm questioning every decision I made. <laughs> uh, oh, I know the feeling. You, like... You, uh, leave a project dormant for, like, a little bit, and then you, you know, you get, like, motivated to revisit it. Uh, and then you look at it and go, what was I thinking? Tight. Alright. Uh, like a school kid around here somewhere. Picnicker gal. Okay, yeah, I see what she's got. Hello, why are you staring at me? Oh, a battle? Yeah, man. This was a. Oddish was going to be one of the Pokemon that I was going to use uh, if Bellsprout wasn't going to pan out for me. Uh, until I learned that Oddish doesn't really learn too many great grass type moves unless you use like a TM or the Move Tutor. So, uh. <laughs> not gonna get too much use out of uh, Oddish this run. theming. I can't remove it now because I have to replan the whole legendary roster. <laughs> Why did I make this one? Or that one? Ugh. Yeah. Those are questions, yeah, questions I ask myself a lot. Like, why did I, why was I going this direction with the story? It's like, why does this note say this? Why, what was my plan? This is mail I got from my daughter. It cheers me up. Yeah, remember... You remember mail? <laughs> There's a gameplay mechanic. You remember the Game Boy printer? <laughs> uh, oh, here's the... Here's the school kid. deep. There are still lots of things we don't know. But I know more than you do. Try me. On the right side, I now have a whole two gym leaders. Hey, that's better than nothing. use a Pokemon that can resist electric type moves even though I'm pretty sure this Voltorb doesn't know any electric type moves
What? The halfway gym and the final gym. I'm very good at playing gyms, as you can clearly see. Well, I mean, I feel like those are good tent pole spots, I feel. Would be like the beginning, possibly the middle, and then the end. And then it would be really easy to sort of put the gyms in that like span those two gaps from like A to B and then B to C. I feel like that would be a good way to to plan it out. Uh, let's let me see here. Um, we're just missing the male poker fan. It's a guy. He's gotta be. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> He's gotta be skulking around here somewhere. We know our Pokemon, even if they dislike us. That's what being a fan is about. I guess so. Pokemon William wants to battle. Send out Raichu. Oh, buddy, you, evol you evolved your Pikachu at like 14? Ugh, bro. <laughs> I, don't I don't think that was a good idea. Oh, you at least let it learn Quick Attack, though. That's that's smart. You're better than Lieutenant Surge. <laughs> Why would Pokemon despise you? What did you do, Pokemon Man? Yeah, that's that's such an odd way to look at it. It's like even if they don't like us, you still have to love them. It's like no, you don't. Ooh, clever, clever girl, boy. Come on, crit, crit. Okay. Oh well. Still got him to got him to sleep though. Nice. Any Pokemon is capable of love, even Satan. Also, that little kid that you got with you looks like Toad. <laughs> From Mario. Yeah, it's true. And that's and that's like one of the um the one of the core tenets of like designing a Pokemon, if I remember right. Is the whole thing is they're like um Uh, you, when you design a Pokemon, it has to, I wouldn't say it has to, but it's like every Pokemon that you design should look like it could be your friend. At least that's what I remember. Got Giratina. Yeah, it's like Giratina is like a Pokemon that you could still love. And you, it could still be your friend, despite the fact that it's like Dragon of the Underworld. Also, I just realized. I don't know if this is like an actual thing, but uh, I just realized that the that in the morning the ground tiles are off white instead of just being white. So I always wondered if there was a difference between morning, day, and night uh, in this game. Because I remember, because I know that, you know, day to night, it's kind of obvious. The lights in the buildings turn on, the, uh, the, it gets like that, that blue tone over it, the lights turn on. You know, the, the, the difference is very noticeable. Um, but the difference between, like, morning and day never really stood out to me a whole lot.
Um, but anyways, um, let me see if I can actually find the Pokemon gem. I think I walked, did I walk past it? It's, yeah, it's right here. Yeah, it's right next to the, the flower shop. Also, I, I think I was, uh, and a, and like adult level, <laughs> uh, or I was like early adult when I realized that the uh, the arena is supposed to be shaped like a Clefairy. Oh, you are a cute little trainer. I like you, but I won't hold back. Beauty Victoria. Should have saved that. Wow, you're really you're holding on to that centric. Sprout evolved into Weeping Bell. Terrible news, I'm a sleep traveler. My sister's apologies. No, that's alright. Go, do what you must do. I shall be here with my new Weeping Bell. That I'm going to switch out for Remoraid. Best shot, or I'll take you down. <laughs> I'll take my shot with my fish gun. G gunfish. Here's me off. Yeah, that's right. All right, we're gonna see how well I do. Oh boy, here we go. Well, guess what? <laughs> Can't lower my attack because I don't use it. Haha. <laughs> Ow. Okay. Coins scattered everywhere. I wonder if you can actually get me off in this game. I remember you could in gold and silver. I think you could still get it in crystal. Nope. like Meowth's. Meowth's sprite in this game. It's a good sprite. Welcome, Jenny. Nice to have you here. Oh, 
I picked up 32 bucks! Nice. Uh, da -da -da -da. Uh, I guess we can put Kurava in the lead real quick. Uh, is there a trainer? Oh, there was another trainer. Just not in the spot that I expected. Looks can fool you. No, I didn't read what you were saying. I was too busy looking at the other parts of the arena trying to find where the other trainers were. So that's, are you going to bite spam? There we go. Alright. Perfect. <laughs> Thought you were weak. I don't know if it's my uh, <clears throat> totally legal copy of Crystal here, but I wonder why the ellipses are floating. <laughs> <laughs> in the text box. It's a little weird. Alright. There's like one other trainer here. Yeah, it's... She's right there. Uh... Oh, wait. Actually... Pokemon I should have been throwing at all these normal types is Nidorina. Because she's the one with the fighting type move. I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon, but I have strong and cute Pokemon. Yeah, you could almost say that they are traits that Pokemon can share that are not mutually exclusive. Hey, Jigglypuff! Alright, should be able to make quick work of these guys. Then once we <clears throat> once we wrap up this fight, I'll go. We'll heal, uh, and then we'll see if I can try and take down Whitney. Because I remember as a child, uh, Whitney would give me a lot of a lot of crap. Because of Mill Tank. Oh, nice. A crit on that last hit. Nice one. Excellent. Excellent. Alright. Go and heal. And we'll see if we can win the day, because we already started off doing pretty well. Uh, oh, and it's daytime. Yeah, so the ground tiles go from off-white to plain white uh, during midday. Okay. I've learned something new. Oh, actually, now that I think about it, there's one thing I haven't done yet was go through the underground. Because I know that there's uh, trainers down there that I could go fight. Oh. 
Hi, Tanya. How are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but I'm bored silly. Huh? Wrong number? Oops, sorry. Hmm. All right, then. the train. The entrance to the underground is like... Name Raider. Uh, no. There it is. Underground entrance. I was challenged to a battle downstairs. It's rough down there. You better be careful. I will take my chances. some rare Pokemon with you. Let me see them. Why, <laughs> I do have one Pokemon that you can't even get in this game. Isn't that crazy? Oh, is this? Oh, this is the guy with the slow pokes. Uh... Okay. Uh, hmm. Eh, we'll switch out. buddy. Donald was defeated. That makes me mad. He makes me so mad. Um, oh yeah, and then there's like the massage guy, the powder lady. This is the coin case? Yeah, there it is. I was hoping to find that. So that way we can go and gamble! like do she he they don't do massages it's in uh or what, is it the massage it's like the haircut of the massage place there's a pokemon game where they do massages for the for like increasing friendship and all that trying to cheat using my Pokemon. Ugh, yeah, that'll happen. The house always wins. Thank you. 
Dang! Man, Neat Arena laying down the crits. Uh, you know what? No, let's get the ball rolling. She is on a roll today. Consider type alignments in battle. If you know your type advantages, you'll do better in battle. Why, I do indeed. steamroll in here. Uh, nope, we got the advantage here. Gonna do some kicking. Babushki. Underground is cleared out. Uh, got some levels. I'm gonna go heal, and then we're going to check. Uh, there's some shops downstairs, but there are also trainers. I'm scared to go down there. Oh man, oops. I'd be scared too if I stepped into a <laughs> if I stepped into an underground area and that music started playing. Yeah, terrifying. Uh, I'm gonna heal, and then we're gonna check the levels of my guys here, and then we're gonna see what happens. Cause I'm a little scared of Whitney. Cause I'm looking at the, just looking at the levels of her, of her little pogies. It's a little concerning, just a bit. go over what we've done so far again uh, we went through and did the bug catching contest and uh, with a little little with some trials and tribulations managed to catch ourselves a scyther and won and got ourselves a sunstone and a scyther which is pretty rad uh, cleaned the national park out of all the trainers got all the items uh, and then managed to work our way here, clear out the gym, and then clear out the underground. So, I'm going to drop a safety save real quick. Uh, oh wait, first I was going to look at my guys. Uh, so I'm going to send Nidorina out first. We're going to see if we can take out Whitney's Clef uh, Clefairy. Uh, we're going to take out the Clefairy. Then I'm going to switch in Weepin' Bell try to wear down the mill tank and then we will send in Nidorina and hopefully we'll be able to 
take it out. Uh, that is the current plan. So we're just going to save. And hope for the best. Yep, can you read the lead? Alright, let's do this. Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Oh, I know. I know. Clefairies are really cute in this game. They're also one of my favorite Pokemon. Oof. Oh, it missed. Nice. Going with the scratch. Excellent. Okay. Whew. Managed to make it through that with some luck. Okay, here comes. Yeah, here it comes. Yes, we're gonna switch in Weepin' Bell. Really making me wish that I, uh, kept Poison Powder on Weepin' Bell. Just a little bit. Oh, cool! It knows Attract. Wonderful. Cool. Cool. All right, cool. Cool. <laughs> uh, what, the, what do I even do now? Because I'm pretty sure it's going to start doing rollout. And it's going to just annihilate me. Ay, ay, ay! Fuck. Oh man, it doesn't help. Mm. Okay, there we go. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. damage, or accrue its damage, Gah. if it, uh, falls asleep. <sighs> Do I wanna... <gasps> Wait, I just got an idea. Hold on, I just got an idea. God, I hope this works. This is a big, big biscuit risk here I'm taking, but... Okay, yeah, I don't think this is going to pay off the way I hoped it would. Come on, get it one off. Cool. 
this thing hits me again, it's going to kill. Yeah, and then it's gonna fucking roll out again, and that's... Hey, Sandfru. I'm gonna take one for the team, buddy. It knows fucking milk drink! Are you fucking for real? So it's got stomp, roll out, attract, and milk drink. Oh my god. take a mulligan on this one, I think, because this isn't... This is going so poorly. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna take a mole again. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. Alright. I don't know, it's, it's, it's terrible. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna try something else here. And we're gonna see how well this goes. Um, real quick. We're going to... On my totally legal... We're gonna just do a save state here so we can save time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. 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 Yeah, you're good, all right. Mm-hmm. Good in the fact that you got... <laughs> you have... One good Pokemon that is... Really tough. I will admit, though, Miltank is kind of cute, though. I do like Miltank as a Pokemon. It's kind of a cute design. 
Now you can start that early, huh? Alright, well. Come on, let me just get one more off. Oh! You know, at this point, I don't really know what good rap is going to do me. Because I don't know how long Weeping Bell's actually going to stay in the fight. And as soon as it wakes up, it's going to tear me apart. sleep. Oh my god! Holy shit! How? How? <laughs> Okay, sure! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, get rid of Tackle, sure. <laughs> that was a complete 180 turn from mere minutes ago. Incredible. Yeah, that's right, bitch. Cry about it. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. You should be so serious, you child, you. Oh, grow the fuck up and give me my badge. Wah, wah. You meanie. Oh, no. <laughs> you made Whitney cry. It's okay. She'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. Sniff. What? You want? What do you want? A badge? Oh, right, I forgot. Here's the plain badge. Cool, you can use strength outside of battle. It also boosts your Pokemon's speed. Oh, you can have this too. Uh, and this is a tract, I think. It's a tract. It makes full use of a Pokemon's charm. Isn't it just perfect for a cutie like me? Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm out of here. Fuck this. Ugh. Yeah, after one full wipe and Kulava holding on by a fucking thread, I'm pretty sure if he got taken out there, he wouldn't have got that level up. But I'm, God, I'm glad I pulled him out when I did. Sheesh. Okay. Whew. Man alive. Uh, right. I need to go talk to... Go talk to this gal here. 
When I told my sis about the jiggly tree, she told me it's dangerous. If I beat Whitney, I wonder if she'll lend me her water bottle. Oh, you're better than Whitney. You'll be okay then. Here's the squirt bottle. Chris is eat squirt bottle. Uh, Chris put the squirt bottle in the key pocket. Don't do anything too dangerous. Wow, you beat Whitney? Cool. Indeed. Uh, whew. All right. Oh, oh boy. Uh, I walked past the Pokemon Center. All right. Hi, Karumba. Hope to see you again. Indeed. All right. Uh, actually, let me do some item, uh, item management while I'm here. Uh, because if I'm also going to be... Uh, fighting Sudowoodo, I kind of want to be prepped for that. Uh, the Quick Claw, we can deposit that. Sunstone, we're not going to use that. Deposit it. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go and buy some Pokeballs. Uh, Pokeballs, maybe some Great Balls. And then we're gonna fight Sudowoodo. Welcome, how may I help you? Uh, you don't have what I'm looking for. Please come again. Welcome. Can I help you? There we go. That's the good stuff. I want ten of these bad boys. And I want ten of these bad boys. Alright. And I'm out. Get on the bike and we'll bebop on over to Pseudo Wudo. Safety save here. And we're going to save here. Um, but before we do that, I'm going to take a quick bio break. I'm going to get up and stretch. So please, controller, stay on the desk, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So, uh, I'm just going to take care of that real quick, and I will be right back.
I'm back. Okay, so we got everybody here prepped and ready. I'm going to send in Weepin' Bell. Oops, that's not Switch. I wanted... Alright. Uh, save again real quick. Use the squirt bottle? Yes! Chris used the squirt bottle. The weird tree doesn't like the squirt bottle. <laughs> the weird tree attacked! Oh. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Sudowoodo, contain yourself. But it's Sudowoodo! Um, okay. I have the type advantage here. I don't want to KO this thing. I want to catch it, which is why I save stated and saved. I'm going to hit it with one Vine Whip. We're going to see what happens. Whew, that's half. Okay. Good enough. Sleep Powder. And now we throw Pokeballs at it and hope for the best. Oh! Okay. One toss, and then I'm going to switch in uh, Noctowl and see if I can chip its health down just a little bit more. Because I think that's what's going to uh, clinch this. afraid of that. Uh, knock out a go. Because if I, <coughs> if I remember right, <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> um, yeah, it's low kick, flail, mimic, and Maybe rock throw? Yeah. Gah. There we go. Get into the red zone. Okay. Poison. Okay. Sudo Widow is fast asleep. Um, Alright. Try again. Here we go. Get in the ball, get in the ball. 
イエスイエスイエス I got to the Udo Imitation If a tree branch shakes when there is no wind, it's a pseudo Udo. Not a tree, it hides from the rain. The wane. It hides from the rain. Whew. Nice. Another successful catch. Give a nickname to pseudo Udo. Nah. Pseudo Udo was sent to Bill's PC. Perfect. Now the pathway is clear. And we can get to Violet City. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh. <laughs> I get some spittle in the carburetor and then I get the hiccups. Just my luck. City. Did you clear that wretched tree? I'm impressed. I want you to have this. Oh, cool. Got TM8. That happens to be Rock Smash. You can shatter rocks with just a single well aimed smack. If any rocks are in your way, just smash them up. Man, hard to believe that. Rock Smash was just a TM back in the day. <clears throat> Alright, Route 37. It's a black apricorn. Perfect. Alright. Uh, let's see if I can sneak past this guy. Uh, we'll put Remoraid in the lead. Oh, perfect. Well, there wasn't a cut tree up here. It's just a... It's a one-way ledge. Uh, okay. I'm going to practice at the dance theater. Care to join me? Hi, I'm Bill. And who are you? Hmm, Chris, huh? you come at the right time. I just finished adjustments on my time capsule. You know that Pokemon can be traded, right? My time capsule was developed to enable trades with the past. But you can't send anything that didn't exist in the past. If you did, the PC in the past would have a breakdown. So you have to remove anything that wasn't around in the past. Put simply, no sending new moves or new Pokemon in the time capsule. Don't you worry, I'm done with the adjustments. Tomorrow, time capsules will be running at all Pokemon centers. I have to hurry on back to Goldenrod and see my folks. Bye bye Perfect. And now with him back, uh, we can go and talk to him, and I think we get the Eevee now. Or at least we can. Uh, in fact, I think I'm going to do that right now. I'm just going to talk to him. Lake of Rage. The appearance of a Gyarados Swarm. I smell a conspiracy. I know it. Okay, buddy. Uh, we're going to deposit. Uh, Sand True. 
for now. There is a cut tree that I'm going to have to deal with in a route very close to here, so... We'll have to get him out eventually. Uh, and then we'll fight... Yeah, we'll fight this guy. Pokemon can't do a thing if they're asleep. I'll show you how scary that is. Oh, trust me, bro, I know. <laughs> how do you think I was able to get the... the past few, uh... Uh, Pokemon I was able to catch. Literally because I was able to put them to sleep. I really hope Remoraid can win this one. Cool. <laughs> well... <laughs> Joke's on me. <laughs> no, Remoraid was not able to win this one. Yeah, nice try. I see what you're trying to do. Try and do Dream Eater again. Yep. Uh, <laughs> not gonna work. Yep, and then everybody just gets some experience points. I lost. That's pretty sad. Eh. You'll get them next time. because it was asleep. Well, that's a fun attention to detail. Never noticed that before. Alright. It's a goldenrod. I believe that it's that psychic or somebody else around here. Um, you can get their phone number and they'll tell you when Stantler show up in that route. completely spaced out there. Whew. Hey, how's it going, Miss Much? Oh, <laughs> Missed a few things. Uh, fought Whitney. Got totally wiped. Had a total party wipe. Then fought her again. Won by complete luck. Um, and then we went and fought Sudowoodo. And I caught Sudowoodo. So now we're going back to talk to Bill and uh, see if we can get the Eevee. Hi Chris, do us a favor and take this Eevee. It came over when I was adjusting the time capsule. Someone has to take care of it, but I don't like being outside. Can I count on you to play with it, Chris? Yeah. I knew you'd come through. Way to go, you're a real deal. Okay, I'm counting on you. 
Take good care of it. Give a nickname to Eevee? Nah. Professor Owen claims Eevee may evolve in new and unknown ways. And there we go. Eevee! Yeah, tackle, tail whip, send tech, and growl. Cool. Ah, uh, the classic Whitney's mill tank. Yup. <laughs> yeah, it uh, definitely proved or lived up to its notoriety. Infamy. Um, yeah, definitely had trouble with it. But we managed to pull through in the end. Oh, hey, Joey. Yo, Chris, how's it going? This is Joey, got a minute? Let's get together and battle. I promise things will be different. Route 3 is where I'll be. Give me a shot when you come. All right, later. Okay, low-key, I do actually want to go and do that. Because we just cleared the path to Violet City now, so we do have that going for us. Sorry being gone a while. Had to hide a body. That didn't... Don't tell me that. <laughs> then I'll be complicit. Uh, well, yeah, but don't worry about it. It's all good. <laughs> Got an Eevee. So much untapped potential. <laughs> Box time. Um, I'm gonna withdraw. Scyther. Real quick. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna look at Scyther. What you got going on, girl? Quick attack, pursuit, focus energy, and leer. Yeah, I don't... It's kind of a bummer. Because like, this is before, like, bug types really got the, the buffs that they so... That they so deserved. Uh, actually, while I'm here, real quick. <laughs> I didn't know you could just call the elevator. That's cool. Uh, we're going to go down to the basement. I don't think this is going to change anything, but I want to see if the... I don't think any of this stuff has moved at all. Oh, this is open. Tight. Got an Ultra Ball. Ultra ball in the ball pocket. Awesome. Um. Okay, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go do trainer battles. We're gonna go fight. Uh, Liz. She wants to fight, and Joey. Oops. <laughs> Let's go beat up some people, yeah! some booze um, and then uh, I probably hit the two hour mark at that point um, so I think after we do this um, we'll be at e critique uh, and then I might Mm, yeah, we can go this way. Because I was thinking, huh? Walk too far today looking for Pokemon. My feet hurt and I'm sleepy. If I were wild Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch. Yeah, see, that's like your hint. That's supposed to be the hint that, you know, put Pokemon to sleep, they're easier to catch. Um, I had. I debated whether or not I wanted to come through here first, because these have cut trees that we could use to access shortcuts, but we're just gonna... 
I'm just gonna speed past these. Because I have that power, and I can use it if I so choose. And for right now, we're gonna take Scyther. Sick him on Joey. Uh, but after this, um, we might hit the two-hour mark, and I might call it there. Um, at least for Pokemon today. Again, doggone it. I'll ring you whenever I get your spell. <laughs> Thanks for the change, homie. Um, but I kind of want to do some drawing today, too. Um, but I might, I'll, I'll take a break, like, in the middle. And, uh, I don't know, I might take a nap, too, because I'm, I'm still feeling a bit... I'm kind of feeling a little bit meh after uh, last night and the total lack of sleep that I that I got. Oh, the, yeah, no, it's total lack of sleep. Um, so yeah, I probably want to take a nap and then, or at least lay down. Um, and then maybe at two, maybe two or three, I'll uh, pick up stream again and we will. Oops, gotta heal first. And, uh, we'll do some drawing. And we'll work on the, uh, the mermaid piece that I wanted to try and do. While we're doing a, a world tour, just sort of running around, um, I will be close to Azalea Town. I should stop there and get the Apricorn that I gave to Kurt, and then give him another one. Oh, I thought you wanted a battle. Oh, it might have been too long. I mean, it has been a week since she called me. Oops. <laughs> Sorry to leave you hanging, Liz. But yeah, we'll go to Azalea Town. May as well. Ooh, I like drawing a little impact toy. Yeah. I will be doing, uh, we'll do that. I'm just gonna zip through some of these. Yeah, I'm just gonna zip through some of these battles in the, in this area. Let me just get to the end real quick. I just finished your ball. Here. Chris received a fastball. That turned out great. Try catching a Pokemon with it. Um, I have 
a black Capricorn. It'll take a day to make you a ball. Come back for it later. I don't like the phrase finished your ball. <laughs> uh, you know, it's just, you just finished making a... You know, he just finished making, make, he made a ball. It's, you know, it's, it'd be more weird if it were plural. All right, we'll heal here. And since Liz didn't want to fight, This is where we'll leave it for now. So when I pick up the game again, actually, yeah, I think we'll leave the stream here, but I'll do a, a little playing afterwards, or you know, off stream, because I'll probably pick this up tomorrow. Uh, not on stream, by the way. Um, and um. I'm gonna do some stuff off stream, like Pokeball Gathering, um, Berry Gathering, and um, a little bit of level grinding. Just a wee bit. Because um, I don't... I'm still not sure who's going to be in the sixth slot of my team. I kind of have Scyther here because I just I want to have her on board for at least a little bit. Um... So, I've... I'm not entirely sure how the party's going to sort out, but I at least want to get Scyther up and do a decent level. I wouldn't mind taking her through, um... Through Morty's gym, at the very least. And maybe getting some other... Some other pogies to take through that gym as well. So, well, we'll, we'll see what I, what I feel like doing once we get to... Um, off-stream stuff. So, let's... Throw down a quick save. Enjoyed last few minutes. I'm glad. Um, and I'm going to see who's on today. Because we are streaming a, a tad early in the day for some of my. Some of my usual peeps. Yeah, it's only seven here. Yeah, I know, isn't that crazy? It's like I'm not streaming at like dark o'clock in other uh in uh, some parts of the world. It's crazy. Oh! Um, actually, there's somebody we could... Uh, could send y'all to. So there's a new, <laughs> there's a new VTuber, not technically new, new to me, that I found relatively recently. Uh, they go by, I think it's Velava. I think it's Velava. Velava tuber. She's like this bunny, deer, tar, centaur kind of person. Her design is really cute. So adorable. So we'll go over and we'll just say hi to her. And then, yeah, we'll pick this up a little later today with some art. Um, so, yeah. Let me, let me 
punch in the... Whoa! Oh, this is new! The... <laughs> Whoa! The... The raid... The raid pop-up is... Way different now. That's crazy. It actually comes up with like a list of people? That's like... Wow, it's crazy looking. Oh, whoa, it even pops up. Oh, wow. This is actually, this is really cool. It pops up with like a window of the stream. It shows how long they've been going. Wow, this is actually really nice. Crazy. All right, anyways. Click the start raid button. Oh, and he keeps on the screen. Oh, so you can even, so you can be part of the, oh my God. This, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, anyways. Uh, I'm just imagining explosions and confetti with how you're acting. <laughs> yeah, I, if we were doing it on my computer, I could actually show you, but I'm doing this on my, on my Chromebook, so I can, you know, I can do two things at once. So, any who's in, thank you for joining me today for this little... This short little journey through Pokemon. Made a little progress. We managed to beat Whitney. We got to Ecritique City. Caught some new pogies. And, uh, yeah. It's been a very pleasant experience so far. Uh, if you're watching the VOD, thank you for making it this far. I appreciate you. And, uh, if you're in the stream, hey, hopefully I'll see you later for some art. Uh, but until then, hopefully I'll see you somewhere out in the multiverse. So, uh, take care, and I will see you later. Bye!